What's up guys, Siobhan here back with another video and today we're going to test out all of Apple's iPhone 10 leather cases or iPhone X, whatever you guys want to call it. But as usual with these case reviews, I always give away one case to a lucky winner. So in order to enter the giveaway, make sure you're subscribed, make sure you drop a like and when the video reach 500 likes, I'll choose a winner. Also in order for me to contact you guys, you need to leave your like hit me up on Twitter at it's underscore Chevy or Instagram at obey underscore Chevy or if you want just tell me which color you want and leave a contact information like an email or something of the sort so then I could contact you when the video gets to 500 likes so without any further ado let's jump into the video and check out all of these cases so here we have a wider range of colors and we also have the Apple iPhone 10 leather folio case but I'm just going to unbox one of these cases to show you the entire unboxing experience so you know what you'd get and then I'll breeze through the rest of the video. So here is the iPhone 10 leather case. So this is the subtle brown one or subtle brown. To unbox it you simply push from the top. It will slide out like this and here we have the subtle brown. So let me just lift this up real quick right here. So this is the case. Inside we have this soft fur finish with keeper iPhone 10 looking really nice if you guys didn't know these leather cases are protected by a small thin cardboard inside and then it's covered with the leather finish so don't expect too much of drop protection or anything like that so in order to put the case in you simply slide in top first and then snap the bottom half of the cases in and then you have your beautiful iPhone 10 I'm not sure I understand. nobody was talking to you you have a beautiful iPhone 10 with your Apple logo and everything like that so yeah we're just gonna breeze through the setup process unbox all these cases and then we're gonna jump back into the video without any further ado let's go into fast forward time Okay guys, so as you can see, we're finished with the unboxing and please bear in mind that Apple has some weird names for these cases. So if I do not pronounce the color right or anything like that, just bear with me because I think this one is called Tuape. I know this is black, obviously. This is Cosmos Blue. This is probably pink, I think, or some something pink. Saddle Brown. This is Dark Aberghini. This is product red and this is also something like a cosmos blue but this is the leather folio case so let me try to find the actual name yeah this is the cosmos blue so yeah let's get into the review or basically unboxing showing you how it looks on the phone and everything so i'm just run through the brown one again i've done it once already but let me just do it again for you guys so we snap the phone case in just like that and here it goes so this is obviously sure stop so no one's talking to you so this is obviously a very nice look it's a very nice feel i really love how it feels in the hand um we have the nice cutouts right here let me get a close-up of that beautiful silver sh not silver but shimmery shining buttons and the tactile feedback is amazing it feels nice it's not as grippy as say for example a silicone case these silicone cases are more grippy and inside the silicone will have the fur finish all round but with the leather cases this is what I was saying it's like it has the leather instead of the fur on the side so it might scratch I'm not 100% sure but yeah that's how the brown one looks let's test out another favorite another favorite is the cosmos blue for some strange reason a lot of people like the cosmos blue so let me try this on real quick just like that guys and look how nice this one looks just look how nice the cosmos blue look guys we're gonna zoom into the buttons so you can see we have that nice shiny blue button on the side this is the sleep button tactile feedback of course it's good let's test out wireless charging so here I have my wireless charger, nothing too s fancy, Chiotech wireless charger, I'll leave, <coughs> I'll leave the links down below for this charger if you want to check it out. So that's the wireless charger of choice, very nice case guys, I really love the leather cases, I think I, I, think I like this Cosmos blue one the most. So we have the bottom cutouts as usual, nothing too protective, 
but it's easy access for any sort of USB so if you have any sort of USB it works well full coverage on the top now let's jump into another case I'm trying to keep this one short and spicy and to keep it under 10 minutes all right so here's the hot pink that's not the actual color but I call it hot pink because it looks like a hot pink case this is mainly for the girls I assume if you're a guy and you like pink too nothing's wrong with that here we have the nice shiny pink buttons on the side that's what I really like. I really like how they did the buttons. Top quality, mute toggle, reachable. Bottom, really nice. So it, look, it looks good in the hand. Look how nice this looks in my hand. You're talking on the phone with this thing. You're gonna draw some attention. This is the attention seeker case. Imagine if you're a girl, you have your pink nails and everything. You look, you look really nice with this case. Rock it with a white outfit, girls. And you, you're onto something right here. <laughs> you're up to something with this case all right let's try another one so this is the black really incognito business like classy stealth so this is the black we also have the shiny metal finish on the power buttons and the volume buttons as well mute toggle in reach same thing at the bottom we have extreme cutout but full coverage on the top so you get the gist of these cases they're very much alike but basically in different colors but then again you get to see how each look in hand and i really like the black one seeing it on camera it looks really nice in person to me it doesn't look nice but on camera with this blue background and everything i kind of dig it i like it i like that yeah very nice case all right let's test out this top the color is called top I, I really don't know where apple get these names from it's like maybe the guy was drunk and they're like yo what you're gonna call this color they said top or maybe i'm just stupid and don't know my colors but i didn't learn the color top in school so this is what top look like honestly this is my least favorite case it looks ugly in my opinion but it might appeal for some people out there you know what i realized though these cases the camera cutout is perfect because I think, yeah, Apple made it, so why not? <laughs> then we have shiny buttons on the side. Shiny buttons on the side again. Perfect. We have full cover, full arm cutout down here and full coverage on the top. And of course, wireless charging works on all of these cases. So, <clears throat> you know what I'm thinking about? I'm thinking about doing updated review on the cases to see like, like months after with the leather cases to let you guys know let's try to put it in unruly so normally apple says that we're supposed to push it on top but i'm just gonna do it from the side let's see if that works as well fair enough that works this one looks really nice whoa i like that like that i like this case i like this color it looks really good with the blue background man whoa Here's the shiny buttons on the side. Shiny power button as well. And just look at the texture on this thing. Obviously, if you use your fingernail and you, you go in, it's gonna leave marks. If you're on a, like a flat, rubbery, not rubbery, but like a rugged table and you take up your phone, you're gonna see scratches and marks. So you have to be careful with these cases. But then again, that's the purpose of leather cases to gain character, charisma, and basically it's telling a story that's what one guy said next up we have the product red so even if you don't have any cases out i'd advise you guys to get the product red one because it's definitely for a good cause so what's different with the product red is that <clears throat> i think it's for charity so you also have the product red inside as you can see with my silicone case we also have the product red inside so these are the two product red cases one is silicone one is leather so you can see that the leather is darker off the bat and the silicone has a more lighter red so this is more of a blood red and this is more of like a fruit red or something like that so let's try the red one on real quick for you guys so unruly sides slide in it's even faster than what apple said so here's the red Red looks good as well. Have no issues with the red. Slap the side on. We have the beautiful side buttons. 
as you can see wow i really like how it looks full coverage not full coverage full cutout at the bottom full coverage on the top let me know what your favorite color guys please let me know and then last but not least we have the apple folio case that cost like over a hundred dollars or something like that it's crazy so here is the cosmos blue apple folio case and basically the special thing about this as apple folio case is that it comes with this metallic detector inside that triggers the display on and off so let me just slide my phone in so you can see my screen is off right now slap it on boom it wakes up my phone screen another good thing about this is that it has sleeves for basically adding you cash cards anything of the sort you could add it in there it also doubles as a kickstand that's what the lady told me i'm not sure how that works i think you do honestly i do not know how this kickstand works, guys but i know it has a kickstand built in also on the back you could see we have the full cutout for the camera down here we still have open openings top full coverage so normally with these folio cases when you want to take pictures it's always blocking the back of the camera but what apple did they made it in a way so you could just slide it over so you could take pictures at the same time which is a great design thought just like that to me it feels flimsy it doesn't have a magnet to like lock the phone so if you turn it over the flaps is gonna flap out so yeah that's it for this video guys um basically i went through all the little cases that apple offers if i didn't go through one it's maybe because apple didn't have it or it was sold out or something like that but i think i did all of them so let me know your thoughts on these cases i'm gonna definitely yeah i'm gonna use this one i'm gonna use this one so here yeah let me just put them in front of you here are all the cases once more if you enjoyed the video drop a like down below let me know which one is your favorite because of course as usual i'll be giving away one of these cases to you guys yeah so if you enjoyed drop a like always guys love peace and tweaks signing out